Thomas and Percy are good friends, but sometimes Percy teases Thomas about being frightened, and he doesn't like that at all. One evening, he was dozing happily, but Percy wanted to talk. Percy went on teasing him. Asked Thomas, exclaimed Percy. Thomas decided to say nothing and went to sleep instead. Next day, Sir Topham Hatt came to see him. Asked Thomas, replied Sir Topham Hatt. Meanwhile, Percy was pushing freight cars into a siding. Henry arrived with his goods train. The singleman changed the switches, and Percy waited on the siding until Henry had steamed by. Then there was trouble, called the singleman, said Percy's driver. Asked Percy, replied the fireman. Percy was speechless. He watched as the other engines went home to the shed. Night time came, and Percy began to feel very lonely. He murmured. It was only an owl, but Percy didn't realize this. He sighed. Thomas was waiting for his mysterious load at the harbor. Suddenly, there it was! Cried Thomas. Laughed his driver. Workmen lifted the dragon onto Thomas's low loader and put lights all around it for protection. Then Thomas set off into the misty night. Percy was asleep on his siding and had no idea that Thomas was approaching him. Percy woke up with a start. Cried Percy. Next morning the switches were mended and Percy puffed back to the junction. Gordon was just about to leave with the express. Gordon was in no mood for puzzles. Gordon snorted. When the other engines heard the news, they laughed too. Chuckled James, huffed Percy. But Percy soon found out that he hadn't. Cried Percy. Whistled Thomas, and explained about the carnival. Percy decided to tell Thomas the truth. Said Thomas. <laughs>